Hello everyone and welcome to CNCF Minutes. In this video, we'll be exploring Thanos. Before that, let's understand a little bit about Prometheus. So Prometheus is a monitoring system, uh, which is a scraper, which scrape metrics from a lot of endpoints. And on, on a very high level, it has four different components, which are compactor, rules, alert, query engine, scrape engine, and the storage, local storage or the SSD. Now, what happens when Prometheus goes down? And you are in between a critical downtime. And when you require the metrics at most, your Prometheus goes down. What happens to the storage? Because it is using the local storage and the re data retention is only 15 days by default. What if you want to query data for six months or a year or a two? What about scaling? Prometheus is, is not uh, highly available by default. So how would you scale? How would you get the metrics from different clusters? How will you get a single view? How will you scrape metrics from thousands of clusters? Now, this is too much troublesome. So you can use the federated architecture, which is not suitable for huge clusters, but for a few clusters, it is fine. As and when the cluster grows, it put pressures on the super cluster and this Prometheus over here will also go down. So in order to solve all these issues, there is a project called Thanos. Thanos was first released in November 2017. It is now a CNCF incubating project. The major goals for Thanos is HA Prometheus. So you can have highly available Prometheus, global query view. So you will be having a single query view from all the clusters where the Prometheus is running, long-term storage and downsampling of the data. So when you're storing the historic data, you would be needing some downsampling and Thanos provides that. So Thanos is a distributed Prometheus and scaling it well. So the above architecture that we just saw for Prometheus is divided like this in Thanos, which are Thanos components, Thanos ruler, Thanos querier, global compactor, and the Thanos will be running as a sidecar. Prometheus will be just storing immediate data to SSD. After that, the sidecar will be storing all the data via the storage gateway to the S3 bucket or whatever the object storage it is. So these are the components. So Sidecar connects the Prometheus, reads its data for query and uploads it to storage. Storage gateway serves as metrics inside the cloud storage bucket. Compactor will compact and downsample the data. Receiver will receive the data from Prometheus remote write and exposes and upload it to the cloud storage. And the ruler evaluates the ru alerting rules against the data for the Thanos and querier will be used to query the data. So this is on a very high level what Thanos is. So this is a simple demo where you have three clusters created and you have Minio as a storage and you have Thanos implemented as a sidecar. You have all three Prometheus in the three clusters and you have a single query view with which you can execute the queries and you can query data for long term. So you can try out different scenarios at Katakura slash Thanos. And if you want to have a deep dive session on Thanos, then you have to put a comment in the comment box. So thank you for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe and press the bell icon and share it with your friends. Thank you for watching.